North Korea is preparing for war. The Supreme Leader Kim Jong-un has fired his top military general, ordered his military to sharpen the war plans, signed off an expanding combat operations of the frontline units, and has called for an increased weapons production and military drills. According to the reports by North Korean state media, Kim Jong-un held an enlarged meeting of the Central Military Commission of the ruling Workers' Party of Korea to make the latest announcements. The Chief of General Staff Park Soo-il has been replaced by General Ri Yong-gil. Kim has ordered an overhaul of the entire military leadership of the country. A number of army generals have either been dismissed, transferred or reappointed during the Central Military Commission meeting. The North Korean military shakeup is only the pre-storm. The top agenda of the meeting was quote-unquote making full war preparations. Tensions are building up again across the Korean peninsula. United States and South Korea are preparing for a pre-planned large-scale combined military exercise along the Korean border. And Kim Jong-un has condemned the Allies' expanding drills, calling it invasion rehearsals. North Korea has used the planned military drills as a pretext to further accelerate his weapons demonstrations, which includes holding military parades, hosting the Russian defense minister in Pyongyang, touring the country's major munitions factories, showcasing its advances in nuclear and ballistic missile technology, and ordering for more war drills to feature the country's newest weapons. The United States and South Korea combined military drills will be held between August 21st to 24th. Just weeks later, North Korea has planned to hold a mega militia parade on September 9th to mark the 75th Foundation Day of the Republic of North Korea. Pyongyang just wrapped up a massive military parade on July 27th this year, which was joined by Russia and China. It was to mark the 70th armistice anniversary of the Korean War, although no peace treaty was ever signed after the war was over. According to analysts, North Korea has never staged military parades more than twice in the same year. Amid the tension across the peninsula, South Korea has announced that it would hold a nationwide civil defense drill on August 23rd. Most of the country's 51 million residents are expected to practice evacuating to shelters or underground safe spaces during the 20-minute nationwide exercise. A Times Online report. From breaking news, detailed analysis, in-depth interviews and explainers. Follow the Times of India. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to like our videos and hit the bell icon to stay updated with the latest.